everybody, this is Justo45 here, and today I'm going to be doing another iPhone SDK development tutorial. Um, so this one will be on animating an image, and so go ahead and open up Xcode, create a new project, view-based application, and we're just going to name it animating images, or image, whatever. Okay, so I have some images here that we'll be animating today and it's basically just a very basic bunny animation so whatever you're animating let's say you already have it just put your images in here in your uh... yeah and now go to your dot h and what you're going to do is make an outlet of the bunny so ib outlet ui image view and we're gonna call it bunny okay so now we're going to make an action and this is gonna be the action that starts the animation of the bunny so IB action start animating okay now in our dot m file or sorry go back to dot h we forgot to synthesize or yeah, make the property the bunny. So at property, non-atomic, and retain, because we want to keep it. IB outlet, UI image view, bunny. And if you can't see it, here's what I did. Okay, so now in our dot M, synthesize your bunny. So it's at synthesize bunny now open redo the action action we called it start animating open bracket close bracket and here is the code you need to to uh, make animate an image it's pretty simple code all you're basically doing uh, I'll explain it after actually okay so first we do bunny dot animation images so the anim equals two open square brackets ns array alloc in it with or not in it with objects and now make the objects that are in your array so in it with objects first one is going to be uh, you're going new line in it with objects UI image, or sorry, I did that wrong. UI image, image named, and let me see what I called it. They're just bunny number PNG. So bunny one dot PNG. Close that. Or okay, comma, and since I have a lot, I'm just gonna copy and paste. So let's copy and paste that. Still have enough bunnies. Okay, and I'm just gonna go through and I have I have 12 bunnies, so you might have different, but it's basically UI image, image named, colon, um, at quotation marks, the name of the file, and any quotation marks, and square bracket, and then do a comma, and then do the next line. So I'm just going to finish this up. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And going to get rid of the rest of them that I made. And then the last thing you have to do is comma and nil. Then close bracket and semicolon. Okay, so now we have what I basically did is I said, I'll zoom in on it if you want to see it first. So what I did is, hold on, sorry. I took my bunny, which is my image view, dot animation images equals, I made an array with the objects of um, of the images. And so now it knows that the animation images is all of these. So the next thing you have to do is 
bunny dot animation duration and this is how long you want each um, how long you want the animation to last so let's say we're gonna make it one and bunny now you can do bunny dot animation repeat count which will make it go um, like if you want to say you only go three times you can do three but since we don't we just want it to go on forever we're just going to just get rid of it don't put it and so the last thing you want to do is bunny in square brackets start animating close brackets okay and so now we have everything that we need so go into your interface builder wait for that to load okay and I don't know why I just like white and so now put in your button name it start link that up to files owner for start animating and now put in your image view sorry and link that up to your bunny and now I'm gonna make you don't have to but I'm gonna make the, um, the starting image my bunny So I'm going to make the starting image my first bunny, and we'll just put it right there. And so now everything is hooked up. Everything's good to go. So build and go. Succeeded. Okay, so we have our bunny, our start button. You press the start button. The bunny starts doing its little animation. Yes, it's not too good, but that is an animation. And if you want, you can mess with the um, duration and stuff. And can make it shorter, so I can say like point, point three, five, so point thirty five. And now it's gonna go faster since I made it less. And so that is how you animate an image. And see you next tutorial. See ya.